Hello, today we're here with Morgan and Wanda, the co-owners of Happy Hills Painting here in Uptown Rapid City, formerly known as the Rushmore Mall. You guys are in the area by Fuji and Live It Up Studio. This is a cute place. Tell us a little bit about your business here. So we offer instructor-led classes, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays, and we offer acrylics, oils, and watercolors. My co-owner here is more into the oils than I am. She teaches very specific techniques, uh, wet on wet techniques, and a lot of the intricacies of that. And then we also do epoxy, floral, wood, all kinds of things here, a little bit of sculpting. We offer everything. When we opened, a big part of it was just bringing our community together and getting a space everyone could feel comfortable in and share their own stuff. So. We do a lot of featured artists here in a lot of community projects. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, twice a day, we do instructor-led, and that just means they're two to four hours depending on what you choose. Acrylics are faster. Some of our more intricate, we offer level one, two, and three here. So level one classes would be shorter, a two-hour class, more for a beginner, and then as you move up, our level three to level four are four-plus hour classes, and that's if you want larger oil paintings that are a lot more intricate, those take a lot more time. So. We liked every calendar is labeled and our websites are labeled as well as Facebook so that when you go to book you can determine what your skill level is and move up accordingly so that you can you can kind of build off of that basis that we start. Um, I was blessed to have the opportunity to go paint with Steve Ross, Bob Ross's son, and Bram Bevins. That's actually how I began this journey before we opened the studio. And I did some extensive traveling, painting with painters from all over the country, actually even other countries. Wonderful experience. And then I was also blessed enough to go to the Bob Ross School and have some additional training there. And, and we're constantly revamping our skills and our skill sets and adding different mediums that we can work with. But that's where primarily I started out with. And then Morgan joined me and started traveling and getting some of that same education that I picked up. We do kids parties here. We do birthday parties, we do anniversaries, private lessons, all kinds of things. So kind of whatever you're looking for, we can pretty well find a time that'll fit that need. So I teach a lot of the kid classes and I really enjoy teaching the little people. So obviously having them of my own, I am very attached to the kid classes. So every week we will pick a different charity organization or any organization that gives back in our own community and donate all of our profits to them. So we want to work with the Wavy Shelter and a lot of the animal rescues and a bunch of the different charities in town that maybe just need a little extra help. We have a Facebook, it's just Happy Hills Painting and our website is happyhillspainting.com. So pretty easy to find us. We get to make our calendar every month, so we pre-design it so that it's laid out so that we've got a fair amount of each level of painting as well as different kinds of paintings. And then you can get on there and see, it'll be labeled acrylic, oil, or watercolor along with what level it is, what price, and what date it is. That way it's nice and easy to follow. I think it's important that we are a mother and daughter team. We're very family orientated. We have a lot of families that come in and paint with us. We have large families that even book the studio as a private event and come in and paint. Um, so I think having that relationship between the two of us allows us to communicate well with with each other, but also to work with our customers differently because we know our strong suits. And I think that for us has been a real asset to us. All right, well, thank you so much, ladies. Awesome, thank you.